The universe waits for us to look closer, and Saturn's story, once thought complete, has just taken a chilling turn. Cassini, our brave explorer, sent back serene images, but hidden in its final data were secrets we never expected. On August 13, 2025, new images reconstructed from Cassini's archives reveal a side of Saturn and its moons that is mysterious and even frightening. These aren't just clearer pictures, they're phantoms in the data, ghosts in the machine. NASA's scientists using advanced AI uncovered patterns once dismissed as static or error, now they're moments of profound strangeness. Imagine looking at a familiar photo only to discover a face in the window you never saw before. That's what's happening with Cassini's data. We're seeing Saturn in a new, unsettling light. These revelations challenge our deepest questions. Are we alone? What forms can life take? The excitement is electric, tinged with awe and fear. The cosmos has shown us something new, reminding us our knowledge is just a tiny island in a vast ocean of mystery. The images we're about to explore are more than science, they're a call to adventure. Cassini's story isn't over, in fact a shocking new chapter has just begun. The universe is stranger and more active than we ever dreamed. Let's pull back the curtain on this cosmic drama. The next images may change everything. To understand these new images, we must journey back with Cassini. Launched in 1997, Cassini Huygens was humanity's boldest mission to Saturn, a two-part Marvel Cassini orbiter and the Huygens probe for Titan. Cassini didn't just fly by, it lived with Saturn, watching its seasons, rings, and moons. Too heavy for a direct route, it slingshotted past Venus, Earth, and Jupiter, finally arriving in 2004. Cassini's mission, unlock Saturn's secrets, its rings, weather, and the mysteries of moons like Titan and Enceladus. For 13 years, Cassini transformed our understanding hurricanes at the poles, ring dances, and a new world on Titan. But every journey ends. In 2017, to protect Saturn's moons, Cassini plunged into the planet's atmosphere, its grand finale. As it dove between planet and rings, it sent back unprecedented data until its final moment. We thought that was the end. But in those last, desperate transmissions, the most shocking secrets were hiding, waiting for us to find them. Cassini's final act was not a goodbye, but a hidden message. The real story was just beginning. Now we're finally ready to listen. Of all Saturn's moons, Enceladus is the most captivating. Cassini revealed it's not a dead ball of ice. It's alive, geologically active, with plumes of water vapor erupting from its south pole. Cassini tasted these plumes, water, salt, and organic molecules, the ingredients for life. But new data from Cassini's final flybys is even more startling. Complex organic compounds, far more sophisticated than before. It's like finding a fully built wall instead of loose bricks. These molecules suggest complex chemistry in a warm, saltwater ocean beneath the ice. This ocean, heated by Saturn's gravity, is now a prime suspect for extraterrestrial life. The new images show the tiger stripes, fissures at the South Pole, pulsing as if the moon itself is breathing. Scientists think this is the ocean sloshing beneath the ice, a living world in motion. The search for life is no longer just about microbes. Enceladus could host something more. What thrives in a dark, energy-rich ocean? The possibilities are thrilling and terrifying. Enceladus is no longer just a candidate for life. It's an urgent invitation to return. Cassini's final message, go back and see what lies beneath. If Enceladus is a world of water, Titan is a world of methane. Saturn's largest moon has a thick, nitrogen-rich atmosphere and rivers of liquid methane carving through frozen landscapes. The Huygens probe showed us an alien shore. Cassini's radar mapped a world eerily Earth-like yet utterly alien. New data reveals transient features, magic islands, appearing and vanishing in the methane seas. Are they waves, bubbles, or something stranger? The latest analysis points to massive upwellings from the depths colossal nitrogen bubbles surfacing and disappearing. This hints at cryovolcanoes beneath the surface making Titan far more active than we thought. Titan's thick atmosphere, complex chemistry, and possible subsurface ocean make it a natural lab for studying life's origins. Could there be two zones for life, methane-based on the surface, water-based below? Titan may be two strange worlds in one. Cassini's last look left us with more questions than answers. Saturn is a world of unimaginable scale and violence, its North Pole hosts the Hexagon, a six-sided jet stream wider than Earth, swirling for decades. Cassini's images showed the Hexagon changing color not uniformly but in swirling, localized patterns, evidence of complex chemistry. Cassini's final orbits revealed lightning storms thousands of times more powerful than Earth's, with visual flashes and staggering energy. 
These are hyper-hurricanes raging across a planet-sized canvas. Studying Saturn's storms helps us understand the engines driving planetary atmospheres, including our own. The hexagon is a natural lab for chaos and order. The lightning, a glimpse into extreme energy transfer. Cassini's last weather report, Saturn's power is beyond imagination. Even in its final moments, Cassini changed how we see giant worlds. Saturn's rings are its most iconic feature, once thought serene, now revealed as a chaotic dynamic system. Cassini showed us the rings up close, a blizzard of icy boulders, sculpted by moons and gravity. In its grand finale, Cassini looked back from inside the rings revealing towering walls of ice, spokes of dust and propellers from hidden moonlets. One startling discovery. Ring rain. Tons of ring material, ice, dust, organics, fall into Saturn every second far more than expected. The rings are dissolving into the planet, a melting spectacle. This means the rings are young, perhaps only a few hundred million years old, not primordial. Saturn's rings may be a fleeting wonder, not a permanent feature. We're lucky to witness them now. Cassini's last glance reminds us, even the most majestic cosmic structures are temporary. The beauty of Saturn's rings is haunting and fleeting. Their story is still being written. Why care about distant moons and storms? Because exploration is in our DNA. Missions like Cassini push boundaries and bring practical benefits. Climate models, new technology, and insights into life's origins. Studying Titan's greenhouse effect helps us understand Earth's climate. Enceladus and Titan's chemistry offer clues to life's beginnings. The technology developed for space often transforms our daily lives. But there's a deeper reason, perspective. Seeing Saturn's rings with Earth as a pale blue dot changes us, reminding us of our fragility and unity. Space exploration inspires the next generation to dream bigger. These missions are a testament to what we can achieve together. They remind us, our potential is limited only by imagination. Cassini's final signals have faded, but its legacy is more vibrant than ever. These new images are not an ending, but a beginning, a cosmic treasure map for future explorers. Each answer Cassini gave us spawned new questions. What's in Enceladus's ocean? What chemistry bubbles in Titan's seas? How long will Saturn's rings last? Future missions are already planned. Dragonfly will fly on Titan. New probes may dive through Enceladus's plumes, and someday a submarine could explore its hidden ocean. The universe is dynamic, changing before our eyes. The rings are raining away, moons are pulsing, islands appear and vanish. The cosmos is a story unfolding now, and we have the privilege to watch. To stop exploring would be to close the book in the most exciting chapter. So next time you look up, think of Cassini, the silent ghost still speaking through its data. The universe is filled with wonder and the potential for discoveries that can shake us to our core. Our journey to the stars is the greatest adventure, and as Cassini's final message reminds us, it has only just begun.